This is an interesting one. There's no fire lettering on the front right here. Well, let me tell you the model number of this thing. It's the Mass 24 LOC. Hmm, never heard of that one before. What could that possibly be? Well, if you guess ceiling strobe, you're right. As you can see, it's a ceiling mount version of the system sensor mass, more so the outdoor version. There's no fire lettering in the front because it's kind of not needed since this is on the ceiling. This is all you would see, fire. Now this would be on some kind of outdoor installation. There's some kind of warnings on here. As you can see, not to be used as an indoor evacuation signal for the hearing impaired. I guess because it has a low candela, 1.5 candela. This is pre-ADA, folks. This has the newer logo, too, so I think this was actually fairly recent. They probably still made these for, like, outdoor purposes or something. Pretty much. Kind of cool, actually. Alright, let's sound this thing. In three, two... One. Took a little while for the strobe to get going there. Well, this is a new in box alarm, so yeah, understandable. Now to activate the alarm, I'll be using the Commercial Products Group 4050-001T. Well, it's obviously in the style of an auto call pull station, but it's been made by Commercial Products Group. I took a look on their website. They seem to rebrand a lot of system sensor devices, wheel lock devices, Gentex devices, and whatnot. Not sure if this is a rebrand, but nonetheless, it does still say Commercial Products Group on this thing. I kind of don't think so, but yeah, still kind of a cool pull station. So, without further ado, let's pull it. Alright, let me show you the inside. As you can see here, it's a switch. There's the label. Commercial Products Group, right here. So, That'll be it for this part, pretty much. Let me just get this screwed in. There we go. Well, that's about it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. That'll be it.